morning. It is Friday, May 5th. <coughs> Just leaving my uh, burger. So anyway, today I'm walking to Camino del Mar. Gonna stop off for some breakfast before I hit the road actually. Um, I should have a reservation. So I was reading last night that that footprint is a tribute to like the Roman soldiers. Um, from a while back. Um, that's all I know about it. <clears throat> the Camino actually goes by the cathedral, which is nice. Um, there's people looking at me in this cafe. As I film myself. Walking by the cathedral. Uh, there's the arrows. That's the building. So now we're back on track. Buen Camino. One of the things that I kind of like about the Camino is, is that when you're walking through these large towns, even the small ones, um, you're on the lookout for these discreetly placed arrows. They're discreet, but they're also in plain sight. And so it kind of just makes it like a scavenger hunt. So now this one's telling me to go right. So you can kind of see here. And so, uh, you just kind of have to keep looking out for these yellow arrows. back to the grocery store because I just realized that I forgot my trekking poles. Um, I think that that's the last place I had them was inside the grocery store and uh, probably what I was going to pay. Um, I definitely had them before that while I was walking um, and then somewhere along the lines I just put them down somewhere. So hopefully they're still there. Okay, got my trekking poles. Oh, that sucked. Uh, but what I realized was that this, uh, the arrow is actually bringing you like a long way around. Using Google Maps, I was get, able to get back to that store much quicker than when I walked around it. So I'll try to take that route again to, so that I can like re-pick up where I came from. Okay, so finally outside Lyon, and I'm at the split where it goes two separate routes. This is the alternate route. You go down here, different cities, um, and this route is actually about 26 kilometers. 
I'm staying on the road route um, and it's only 20 kilometers but I'm actually stopping in here San Martin del Camino that'll put me at about 24 for the day um, and then I'm gonna pass these and stay do another 20 and stay just before Astorga tomorrow but um, yeah uh, the road route I mean it is what it is it's fine that's the uh, alternate route um, what else? Uh, I want to walk a certain distance uh, and uh, that was a city that popped up uh, I wasn't sure which route it was on but happened to be on the road route okay so I just took a look at the map and this is going all the way along the highway um, so it just runs parallel to this highway this is gonna suck Valverde de la Verde I can't really see it but at the top they have those nests of those birds okay so this saddle is kind of long um it doesn't fit it might be like three euro three fifty two fifty depending on where you buy it and it comes in here it has separate pieces here there's chicken tomato olives and cheese i gotta stay away from the cheese um no bueno gotta have meat e also comes with a fork and inside here you have arugula and just mixed pasta bow tie pastas that's pretty awesome right figure out where my uh, um, hostel was um, but I'll be glad to actually I think that's it right there this crowd looks different I don't recognize any faces kind of sucks but the albergue looks nice Not too bad, a little warm. But I uh, I started late, so it's kind of my fault. Okay, so I'm here at uh, Albergue Los Huelos. And for dessert, actually in their freezer thing, they sell these Filipinos ice cream. And um, I saw the cookies. Um, had those. I kind of like them. Some people don't like them, but I like them. Uh, but then, this is an ice cream sandwich. And I love ice cream sandwiches, so I had to try this one too. Uh, so this is interesting. So it's kind of like a half ice cream sandwich. And the other half is dipped in, I don't know what that is. And then it's coated with like nuts or toffee or something.
so this yellow I don't know what that is it's not quite vanilla kind of tastes like butter ice cream butter toffee definitely chocolate softer than what an ice cream sandwich would be it's okay um, don't think I would get one again, but not a fan of this. Just kind of like sugar or something. But luckily it just pops off pretty easily. I came out of here because I forgot that I have my clothes still drying out there. So I have to go out and pick that up in a little bit. Mm, it's pretty good. It's okay.